Rumors are swirling that Jamaica's upcoming match against Venezuela could be Jaime Holgrimson's final game in charge of the Reggae Boys. The Jamaica Football Federation, JFF, is reportedly considering parting ways with the coach due to the team's poor performance. However, Holgrimson is said to be unhappy with the Federation's unprofessionalism and lack of support. Sources close to the team reveal that Holgrimson has been forced to pay for his own plane fare to scout players in Europe, a move that has left him feeling undervalued and frustrated. The coach has already cleared out his belongings from the JFF-provided house and is rumored to be planning a return to Iceland. Holgrimson's relationship with the players has also become strained, with several key players reportedly losing faith in his leadership. The coach's attempts to recruit Leon Bailey, the controversial Aston Villa attacker, have been met with resistance from the players, who feel that Bailey's inclusion would be a betrayal of the team's values. The tensions between Holgrimson and the JFF are multifaceted. The coach was upset by the appointment of Altamont Freddie Butler as an assistant coach and has expressed concerns about the Federation's support for securing passports for UK-based players, such as Arsenal's Rice Nelson. Additionally, Holgrimson and the JFF are at odds over the direction of the youth program, with the coach pushing for more non-domestic players and the Federation advocating for more local-based players. As Jamaica prepares to face Venezuela, the future of Holgrimson's tenure hangs in the balance. Will the reggae boys be able to turn their fortunes around, or will Holgrimson's departure mark the beginning of a new era for Jamaican football? Only time will tell. Thanks for watching, like, share, and subscribe for more updates on Jamaican football and the latest developments in the Holgrimson saga. Hit us up in the comments section and let us know what you think about the situation. Do you think Holgrimson should stay or go? Should the JFF prioritize local or international players? Let your voice be heard.